हेलो किड्स हाउ आर यू ऑल लेट्स रीड अ चाइल्ड हुड स्टोरी ऑफ अवर गॉड गणेश जी द गॉड ऑफ विजडम एंड गॉड ऑफ फॉर्चून एंड हाउ गणेश जी हैज एन एलिफेंट हेड लॉन्ग एगो गॉड शिवा एंड हिज वाइफ गॉडस पार्वती लिव्ड ऑन माउंटेन कैलाश वंस पार्वती जी वॉज एलोन एट होम she did not have anyone to guard the cave then she took some turmeric powder in her hand and began to pray soon soon a young boy stood before her the boy then touched parvati ji's feet She named him Ganesha. Parvati told Ganesha to stand at the entrance of the house and not to let anyone inside. Ganesha did so. Days passed. Ganesha would spend his time by either sleeping or eating laddus. A few days later Lord Shiva returned home Ganesha stopped him at the entrance and said You cannot go inside Shiva was shocked as an unknown boy was stopping him from entering his own house Lord Shiva said step aside this is my house Ganesha said no i will not let you go in this is my mother's house you go away Shiva got very angry at this disrespect he took out his trident and we had at the boy then he entered the house shiva shouted how dare that boy stop me from entering my house when parvati ji heard this she rushed she rushed towards the gate and found ganesha's head and body lying separately on the ground parvati was extremely angry she started crying and said mahadev how could you do this parvati ji continued crying shiva lord shiva was sad when parvati told him the entire story about the ganesh so he ordered his helpers to bring the head of an infant whose mother was sleeping with her back to the infant the helpers could not find such an infant except for an elephant so Shiva put the elephant's head on Ganesha's body and breathed life in it. Shiva then said, "People would worship Ganesha before worshiping any god. Ganesha would be considered Vigneshwar, the remover of all difficulties." Thank you kids. Share and subscribe.